We did it, everybody. This is like, this is a big deal for me. I'm gonna go defeat him in arm wrestling. Here we go. Ah! You just got beaten by a woman. Maybe you do need to arm wrestle a woman. A real woman. God damn it. I hate this. Get up a fight. Come on. I'm put trying. Up a fight. drama backstage in New York. Heard something with James O'Keefe. Drama? Oh, they were probably talking about when I arm wrestled Tulsi Gabbard backstage. Keep it going for Chrissy, everybody! Let her hear it! James? It's great to be here, man. So much James, James Ben? Last two years ben? What happened? See the fight? James ambushed Ben. It was too much. Yeah. And I didn't get the I imagine it'll come up. Tons of black friends. <laughs> I would imagine it will. He uh, he lied to, he lied right to the camera about what I just said two seconds ago. Let's talk about it so much. Let's talk about it. I'm not a fan. Oh, that drama about James O'Keefe. God, I hate that guy. Why doesn't anyone ever talk about me? I got a hot date at the show. She came up to me, out of nowhere. Tall, blonde, beautiful, completely out of my league. This is so crazy. Like, girls that look like you don't usually date guys like me. You feel it though, right? I do. So, okay, let's start with Vice. I feel like they're all filthy, woke frogs. I just want to start naming names. But you're just so pretty and this never happens to me. I don't know. I just feel like you, you get it. I do. It's your personality. Oh, thank you so much. I mean, you know, not to be, uh, not to play too cool, but... Ah, crap! It's your personality. Ah, you had tits! So Jamie and thinks he has a date, and then the date is James O'Keefe. No, I didn't go on a date with James O'Keefe. I went on a date with a beautiful lady who happened to turn into James O'Keefe. the second and third dose, the fourth, fifth, and sixth, as soon as you get called up, you'll know where to run so I can get the perfect chair with these guys. We end raising our What did I lie about? I just said it twice, but I'll say it a third time. I'll release the full raw video tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I'm, sh I'm sure you... I, I will be fascinated. I will be fascinated to see if it's that's, actually that's the full video. Hey, Ben. James. Hey. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. How you doing? Are you excited for the panel? I am, yeah. Hey, this, this one clip here of you talking about the Teachers Gone Wild video. Yep. Uh, remember this? Yep. Uh, um, you talk about the video games laughing on their dime. Yep. Union officials, remember this? <laughs> right? <laughs> laughing while playing video games. Mm -hmm. And then you kind of mocked that because it was like, what's the point of that? And like, I, I kind of agree with it if that was the only thing that the video showed. But 10 seconds later in that very video, which you cut from, was the woman talking about uh, using she an she says the n-word to, word to a student right mm -hmm. 10 seconds later <laughs> right yeah so uh, so i'm glad to know that you have uh, that you've had this moral epiphany about no, selective I, editing you know, just so you know i showed him the clip i i found the clip mm -hmm. and i was just kind of i was just kind of wondering i saw that you were mm -hmm. a professor from morehouse an adjunct professor and i was just curious how you thought that a teacher saying the n-word were you saying it's okay for new jersey black uh, students to be called the n -word by union <laughs> official yeah so i think that uh you're not actually wondering that i think that you're a very dishonest person if you're pretending to wonder about that i think that the function of a union one of the functions of a union is to provide people with representation and the best defense possible they can get in the context of a um disciplinary proceeding 
the same way that a lawyer would provide you with representation in the best defense possible. Why did you edit the tape to exclude the N-word mentioned by the union officials? Uh, people often say to me that James O'Keefe is deceptive or manipulative. I'll ask why, and they might say he deceptively edits. I'll, I'll ask the same thing. I'm like, okay, absolutely. Where, when, how? And uh, there's no, there's, there's never been an example presented to me. There's been an argument that, oh, sometimes the, the, the people who he's speaking to, maybe the context isn't as, 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 like, as grand as maybe James framed it. But I, I like to point to, I think it was Channel 4 in the UK that did undercover journalism the exact same way that James O'Keefe did. When they did it, it was on Brexit, and it was celebrated across the media sphere. So I'm just like, look, if I can look to Project Fairtime, and I can look to Channel 4 and I can see them doing the exact same thing and you can't present evidence of wrongdoing, I can only see undercover journalism being done. Why should I make a negative assumption? So, Jim. Yeah. Yep, he's definitely dead. But I was the only one here. I'm gonna get blamed for this. What are you doing? I'm wiping my fingerprints off of them. You're rubbing them on. You're an accomplice to this. Look, I don't want to take any chances. I did not kill Brett. But in this day and age, I don't want to get called out on Twitter for killing Brett. So naturally, I have to go bury the body. Let's just start with looking at the outsized influence that the corporate for-profit entertainment media has. who they're going to cover, how they're going to cover them, and, uh, and therefore what perceptions they're creating in voters' minds. What are we doing? We have to bury the body. Did you even check his pulse? There's no time. You ever want to come yeah, on the show? Let me know. Yeah, yeah we, we, we've all... So is everyone everyone's a big fan of you. So, I got you on, I follow you on Twitter. Is everyone yeah. making yeah. 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 Or talk to Jamie. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, right. yeah. 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 come. If there's yeah. one thing yeah. Yeah. we want you guys to do. Ready? <laughs> Three, two, oh, elevator, right by, photobomb! What a photobomb! Yeah. Yeah, no, he's okay. I saw him walking around. That's great news. I hope he doesn't watch this vlog. Because you were about to bury him alive? Shut up. Crack that champagne! Champagne! We are in a movie vehicle. This is Chip a jam! This is extremely Open it up! I will take wanna, no part in this. Do you do it? Alcohol in an automobile? Certainly not. Certainly not. That honors? is irresponsible. That, that is not an honor, ma'am. That would that would honor me not. Rather irresponsible. Guys, this can't be legal. It's scandalous. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh, like I said, yeah. you popped it. I guess I'll have some. I guess so. I'm so. Hold on. I'm still going to judge you guys for drinking it, but I will also drink it with you. <laughs> How many of those fancy glasses do we got? We got eight. Eight fancy glasses. Whoa. Eight fancy glasses. Oh, no. Oh. Hold on. That was perfect. It was like pretty perfect. Except for the part where it almost fizzed over. So that's actually not what's supposed to happen, Allison. Thank you. Oh, uh, thank you. Whoa. <laughs> Look at that. Zero G. They put champagne in limos. Not because it's legal to drink alcohol in a moving vehicle when it's a limo, but because they know the police will assume you're rich, so they won't pull you over. <laughs> Boom. And that's actually that's truth to power, Seamus. I'm swell. That's what. That's how this country is. Well, it's been an emotionally confusing week. Tulsi Gabbard beat me in arm wrestling. Zuby beat me in arm wrestling and claimed to be a woman. I thought I had a hot date, but it turned out to be James O'Keefe. So I guess I went on a date with James O'Keefe. But. I got to perform at the Beacon Theater, and most importantly, Tim promised that I could ride in a limo and back to Cass Castle, finally, on that private plane. There's no way they could forget me twice. Right? This has been a great event, Seamus. Allison, this has been a blast. Thank you so much. I feel like we're forgetting something. 
More champagne for it! Oh. Woo! Yeah! They forgot me in the limo, but it's fine. I talked to Tim, and he said as long as I can get myself to the airport, I can still ride in the private plane. No one gets left behind three times. I have a very serious announcement. We've forgotten something. They forgot me three times. Nope, nope, it's James O'Keefe. How did I fall for this? Is this seat taken? No. Uh. <laughs> Would you like to see yourself on video saying all the corrupt things? No, of course I don't want to see myself saying all the corrupt things. How do you keep it? I have here my iPad. I can, I can show you. No, I don't want to look at the iPad. Everyone always looks at the iPad.